Slash my dudes, welcome back to another video. Today, we're gonna be doing some tips and tricks on customs. Yes, this voiceover sucks. These LPS are fake. I will get into the details later in the video. So the first step I usually do is get my acetone out that I got from Publix. And acetone works so much better than normal nail polish remover. So I definitely recommend using acetone, especially if you want to redo a custom. It takes everything off, and I just feel like it's a lot stronger than normal nail polish remover. Then the next step I do is I start planning out my custom. And today I'm going to be using this glass eye from eBay. I bought 20 of them for $2. What I'm going to do is I'm going to take my glass eye, draw a circle around it, and simply start cutting it out till it makes a hole in my LPS. I do recommend using the cheap fake LPS to use glass eyes, especially for beginners, because hard plastic fakes and real LPS are a lot harder to cut into. Next thing you're obviously gonna need to do is glue in the eye. I put hot glue down first, and then I take my Dollar Tree super glue and secure it in. Always remember to put hot glue in the back of the eye first, because if you don't like how you, it turns out, you can easily just take it out and if you put super glue down it's going to be so hard to take it out it usually takes me about 30 minutes to actually get the eye in the perfect position so if it's not how you like it then just keep trying you'll eventually get there yes this is my jam if you like pina coladas <laughs> Everything's all right. Ah, hooked on a feeling. So I didn't want you guys to get bored. I decided to um, spice it up a little. You know, you gotta spice things up, you know? And I posted a post on Amino a month ago because I filmed this a month ago since all the craziness has been happening. And I'm gonna be answering your guys' questions. The first question is from Cat Girl, and her question was, what kind of paint do you use? The type of paints I use are Folk Art, Apple Barrel, and Craft Smart, but I usually use whatever I can find. I do not recommend using Sharpies or nail polish. Both of these will stain the pet, and also nail polish just gets really gross and sticky. The next question is from LPS Fun Times. And her question is, how do you sculpt with hot glue? Well, sculpting with hot glue is pretty hard. I do recommend using clay for beginners. I don't personally like clay, but I mean, hey, whatever floats your boat, do it. <laughs> I don't know. To sculpt with hot glue, you're gonna need a cooking sheet. Yes, a cooking sheet. Not the paper kind. It won't end too well, trust me. Then the next thing you're obviously gonna need is a hot glue gun. Then you're gonna start building your design on the cooking sheet. Make sure you let it dry for a little bit because if you pick it up too early, it will start to curl unless you want it to curl. And if you want it to be completely flat, let it dry. It will be hard to pick it up if you let it completely dry though. Comment down below if you wanna see a video on how to sculpt things with hot glue because there's still a lot of details to sculpting with hot glue. So let me know if you wanna see that video. So the next couple of questions are from Instagram. The first question is, any tips for customizing? Always remember to put a little bit of water in your paint to water it down so it doesn't get chunky. I've made that mistake way too many times. But then make sure you don't put too much water because then you're basically just doing watercolor. Next question is, how long does it usually take you to make one custom? It really depends how much detail I'm putting into it. If I'm making just a simple custom, it usually takes me about six to five hours. If I'm putting a lot of detail into it, it can take up to two to three days. The next question is how do you get your custom ideas? Normally an idea just pops into my head, but half of the time I don't know what I'm doing and I just like go with the flow and I just get really creative along the way. Very rarely I'll get inspired by other people, but most of the time if I do get inspired it's by a TV show or something. Last question is what type of LPS do you use to make your customs? I always use fake LPS. I normally buy a big lot of the cheap fake LPS. I find that the soft plastic fakes are a lot easier to use because you can just pop off their head and add it to another body and be really creative with them and you can easily like cut things off. That sounds terrible, but 
it's true. I do use the hard plastic fakes, the fancier ones, but if it's a good looking fake and it looks real, I normally use those ones for videos. I try my best not to use real LPS because someone in the world could be wanting that pet and I just used it for a custom. The only time I actually use a real LPS is if it's severely damaged and there's no way I can sell it, fix it. That's when I actually do start customizing it. I only have a couple of LPS customs that are actually real LPS and it's because when I was younger, I didn't know that LPS were valuable. So I painted the real LPS with nail polish and Sharpies so it stained the LPS so there was no way that I could fix it back together or anything like that. So if you're a beginner, try to buy fakes because if you practice on a real LPS and you mess up real bad, it's going to go downhill real fast unless you know what you're doing. Well, there you have it, folks. I hope you enjoyed all those questions, and I hope they helped you in any possible way. If you have a question, comment down below. I will try to get back to you and answer. Also, comment down below if you want to see just a video about how I sculpt things with hot glue. Let me know in the comments below. I hope you guys enjoyed the rest of this video, and have a great day!
And here is the finished product. So thank you guys so much for watching this video. I'm so sorry that you didn't get to see the entire paint job, like how I did the designs and all that. But to be honest, doing designs is super easy. All you gotta do is just paint dots and stuff. I don't use a dotting tool or anything, I just use the paintbrush. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I know it wasn't perfect. I'm going to be doing a All My Customs video soon. I also just want to apologize again for not posting anything. I feel really bad. I'm not quitting LPS Tube or anything. I've just... A lot of stuff has been going on. I hope you guys understand. I'm so sorry. Hunters should be coming out. I hope it does. <laughs> Zoe, in the future, please film it, get it out. Um, I would really appreciate it if you guys didn't copy these customs because these are my original characters. I came up with the names and the designs for them and everything. And uh, I'm totally fine with you guys being inspired by them. Like if you like how I did the wings and you try to make the wings, I do not care, just don't cut, copy the custom completely. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I'll see you guys next time. Bye!